Hi there, Daphne here with Second Half Travel Adventures with the great privilege today of inter introducing you to another person who loves worldwide travel just like me. Mm -hmm. He is a senior coach at Entre Institute and he's been responsible for taking me on an absolutely incredible journey that I want to share to you. So let me introduce you to Dan Martin. Hello, everybody. I'm Dan Martin. Nice to meet you. Hi, Daphne. How's it going? Good. 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 It's great to be here. Great to be here. Yeah, you said I'm a travel enthusiast. You're not lying. I'm, I'm as bad as you are, right? I just love to <laughs> see the world, see new places, taste new foods, experience cultures and people and and build relationships. I'm I'm so excited. I don't know what trips you have coming up, Daphne, but I'm I'm going to be going to um, Korea, South uh, Korea, and and South Vietnam in February, and we're going to Puerto Rico in November. And in the next, uh, let's see, ninety days, I'll be in Colorado three times. I'll be in Austin, Texas three times. I'll be in Dallas, Fort Worth. We'll have to connect, right? Yeah. I'll be in L.A. I'll be in uh, Las Vegas three times. I mean, I get to do a lot of traveling. It's so much fun, and that's why when you came to Entra, it was awesome because you were like, "I want to travel. Let's let's talk travel." Yeah, I love it. Well, my next trip, you want to know where that is, and that is to Vladivostok, Siberia where my grandmother has a statue, my American grandmother, we believe has the only, is the only American that has a statue in Siberia. Wow, in Siberia? She's, yeah, she's, well, she went there as a young bride to open an import-export business with her husband to the United States. And she took pictures and she wrote letters home. It's the only, wow. only history they have of Vladivostok at that time. In the wow, no kidding. Yeah. It's so amazing. I'm going to go to see that content. Arms, I'm going to go put my arms around that statue of my grandmother. That's awesome. What a great, great trip. Who would have ever thought to visit Siberia? That's just such a interesting and unusual place to visit. Good for you. Yeah. That'll, so be, excited. That'll be next February. You can see real life see similarities. Next yep. <laughs> the family, right? You, you, you get the looks, right? Uh, awesome. Okay, Dan, well, uh, let's let's get these people that are watching started on learning how to be a success doing something different than what they're doing right now. I love it. I love it. And thank you for letting me come and, and talk with you and, and your folks today, because I think there's, you know, from somebody who loves to travel, there is a really special uh, place uh, when you are sitting on a lawn chair at the poolside uh, cabana with a umbrella cocktail in your hand and a laptop device in your lap, enjoying 82 degree weather on Coronado Island in San Diego while you're working, of course, you know, and I think that's something that everybody should be able to do to travel more and not be restrained by the, your work boundaries and, and those things. Um, so if that's, if that's you, if, if you're looking for an opportunity to travel more, or maybe it's just an opportunity to travel better, I mean, this is this is a, a really fun topic for me. So I'm going to give you three things you can do to travel more, okay? And um, the first thing is, you know, of course, you know all about it because you're that's really what you're doing right now. You're building that yourself. That's the affiliate marketing business. And, of course, affiliate marketing, for those who don't know what affiliate marketing is, it's really a wonderful, wonderful way for people to get involved in an online business without having to buy product, without having to have inventory, without having to store and ship and pack and, and do all the record keeping and, oh no, this person had a return and this person didn't like the color. Well, it didn't look the same as it did. You know, all, all those things that people think of when they're selling online products and services. This is a way that you don't have to worry about any of that. And uh, so I, I love the idea of uh, affiliate marketing. Um, affiliate marketing means you're going to find a customer, a person, a friend, or you're going to build a friend who has a problem. And you're going to find a product that offers a solution to that problem. So you're going to look for a product. Maybe it's not your product, but you're going to look for a product that, that solves that problem. And then you're going to connect that person with that product. And the product is going to pay you a commission for being the middleman, right? And it very, very simple. You see it all the time. If you ever watch a YouTube video, well, you, you do it in your videos, Daphne. If you watch a YouTube video, there'll usually be links to different affiliate products in the description, right? And when people click on that and they go buy the product because they watched your video, 
then you make that commission. And that's what, did I, did I make that clear, Daphne? What do you think? Yeah, and I, I think the main thing about the products is, is that they, they hook up with what the need is of the person. In other words, it's not, it's not selling socks to somebody that wants to go to Europe on a trip. <laughs> right. oh, unless maybe they're compression that. socks for the airplane. And then the <laughs> socks would be, a, maybe that wasn't a good example, but you know what I mean. Right, right, right. Yeah, yeah. You're looking for, um, you know, a, a community, really. You build a community of people and you you get to know those people. It's been a lot of fun, right? I, I think watching you get to know your community has been fun too, because I know you do a lot of outreach as an affiliate marketer. You're building relationships every day with new people who share that passion of travel, right? Yep. Yeah. Uh, um, Daphne, let's talk about the big white elephant in the room here, okay? And sure. that would be that people who have tried affiliate marketing before maybe didn't have success. There's a lot of opportunities for loss in affiliate marketing. Is that an, do you agree with that? Do you think? Yeah, I do. I know that you, I mean, even you, you've had great success now, but also you've, you've had struggles too. Building it is hard. It's yeah. not the easiest thing you've ever done. It takes no, time. It takes not. commitment. But it, you know, you have to keep your eye on what the end goal is. And, and if you've got the time and the energy and the desire, I guess more than anything else, the desire to succeed, then most likely you're going to. Yeah. Well, then, you know, if you enjoy writing or if you enjoy being on video, it's it really isn't work. Right? You no. can build it on this. So the right way to do it, you know, people who say, I'm quitting my job and I'm going to, no, don't quit your job. Not yet. Build it <laughs> and then quit your job, right? Yeah. And so that's always the right way to do it. So we, that's where you get that term. And I, I don't really like the word for it, but they call it a side hustle or a side gig or whatever. Yeah, know, I don't like that either. Thing. But maybe, is that just because we're a little bit older, Dan? I think it's generational. Yeah, I really yeah. do. I really yeah, do. I think, I think that so. means something yeah. different. Because hustle used to, if you were a hustler, that was a bad thing. But now yeah, hustle that was, is a big That deal, had right? quite, a, quite an unfortunate connotation. It did. It did. Yep. But but building a business on the side while you're working a job or while you're doing your own thing can turn into a full-time job or business or company or whatever you want to call it. Don't call it a job. A J-O-B is no good. But a company of your own, at least. <laughs> that now you can go out and travel and, and do those things. Yeah. Well, and how about um, how about the agency business? I mean, that's, yeah. another, that's another aspect of this, which I think is just so helpful to people nowadays, especially with inflation and everything else. People are wanting to make more sales. <laughs> And sometimes they don't know how, and that's where I can really come in and help them by showing them how to be have a bigger and more prominent presence online. You know, Daphne, um, one of the great things about being in our community, right, and, and I know you've seen it firsthand, is that you're surrounded by a really, really powerful team of people. And so I, you, you, you walk Dynamic right into team. my number two. Yes. Right. We have the, all these resources uh, at your fingertips. And so the second way to make money uh, to, to live, live in a lifestyle that allows you to travel. That's really what I want to say um, is build a digital agency. And you might say, what is, what does that mean? Well, a digital agency is just like an advertising agency. Only it focuses on digital advertising. Really, you don't do a lot of print and TV and radio and those kind of photo shoots and magazines. It's different. It's all the digital. It's your search engine optimization. It's your social media. It's your website. It's your Google reviews. How yeah. how good is your business at communicating with Google so Google sends you free traffic, right? Yeah. Things like that. So that that's a really that that's another opportunity, and I just really appreciate all of your suggestions today. And I think the people that are listening are going to be so grateful to perhaps have a different uh, path to take in life if they so choose. And I want to thank you so much, Dan, for spending this time, your valuable time as one of my favorite people in this business. And uh, it's been wonderful having this chat and I hope it'll help the people that have been watching. Oh, that's awesome. That's awesome. Well, I have one more for you. I told you okay. I would give you three. I've only given you two. Okay. So the digital agency was the second one. And that is that that is really just a wonderful platform too. 
but but the third one is really my personal favorite this is the one that i really focus on for my business is creating a course a knowledge course or a coaching program that you can help others you leveraging the information that you already know and by building that course and selling it online or building the coaching program which very very similar sometimes they even work hand in hand selling that to people online is a great way to make money again while you're traveling you can go write courses from a cafe in paris in the middle of the day with a glass of red wine well, that, right well, that sounds whatever. great yeah <laughs> awesome awesome That's those great. are the three things that i do and I, d I don't mean to give you a shameless plug here daphne but i, I do want to say all three of these businesses are absolutely legitimate we have tons of students making great money doing this tons of clients uh, that that have learned these skills and, and are doing well. And I just want to say that if you, if you're interested in this, I highly recommend, I know I'm biased. I work with Entre Institute. I have to give them a, like I said, a little shameless plug, but I'm very, very proud of what we've built at Entre. And I've had the blessing of seeing lots and lots and lots of make money online programs and, and uh, opportunities, right? Hey, I hate that word opportunity. When I see business opportunity, I usually run. This is a legitimate training program that takes you from the beginning to the end of building any of those three offers. So if you guys want to travel more, Daphne, are you going to have a link to any of this? Do you think, are you giving a link out on in this or is this just for information? No, we'll, we'll give out a link on this. Okay, good, good. Yeah, I, th I think you should, because listen, if you're looking for this type of business, this type of freedom to go out and, and, just live large. A change of lifestyle. Yeah, you need a mentor. Yeah. You need training. You need education. You need mentorship. You need somebody who can say, don't click that button. Click this button. Don't say that phrase. Here's an idea for you. What do you think about blah, 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 and walk you through that process to make sure that you're doing everything right. And if that's you, if you need that and you want that, reach out to Daphne and check out that link. Well, thank you so much, Dan. And have wonderful travels over the next couple of weeks. And I so appreciate you spending this time with me today. And I hope that all the people that are watching this video will move forward to maybe possibly make a really important change in their life. I hope to see you all there soon. Thanks for having me, Daphne. I appreciate it. You're welcome. And Have a good day. Live large, everyone.